The mind is in the world of plurality. The world of plurality is constantly changing. Therefore, the mind goes on changing from joy to sorrow, from I mean, uh, pleasure to pain. It goes on changing. Since you and I are at this moment identified with the mind, we also are sorrowful. I am very unhappy. Which part? Why are you unhappy? Samji, I am feeling very miserable. Where? In my mind. Where is that? On your elbow? Or on your knee? Where, where is it? Uh, that, uh, my mind. Isn't it? You are unhappy because the mind is unhappy. When the mind is unhappy, why should you say that I am unhappy? See? Who told you that the mind is unhappy? That I know. How do you know? I can see it. When you are seeing that your mind is unhappy, how can you be unhappy? Sympathize with your mind. Tell your mind, unfortunate, that you are feeling unhappy. I wanted you to be happy, but when you are happy, come to me. Now at this moment you get out. Why? I don't want to see you unhappy. That is to say, my dog is lying next to me. The dog is scratching its ears. No doubt it is my dog. No doubt about it. Do you also scratch? And I ask, what are you doing? No, scratching the ears. Why? The dog is scratching. See that? My dog. My dog is scratching. How can it be you? My dog is an object. It belongs to me, no doubt. And I love it. Perfectly all right. But the dog scratching is not my scratching. I am totally a different entity. You are conscious of your mind. The mind is in an unhappy mood at this moment. Why should you be unhappy? You are the knower. The mind is the known.